Hello, and welcome back to another episode of Robbie Does Something Crazy. I'm your host, Dum Dum. And I know what you're thinking. You like my shirt. I like it too. Thank you. Yeah, so I did something crazy and stupid and, well, not that crazy. Silly. And I know some of you are probably already on to me and know exactly what this is about. But before I show you, once again, hats off to you guys. I cherish your comments. Hands down, nicest comment section on all of YouTube. Wish my TikTok comment section was like that. There, 50-50, 98% of my comments on YouTube are amazingly positive. You know how I know why? Because I read almost all of them. So if you have something you'd like me to read and most likely interact with, leave a comment. I'm actually gonna pin my favorite comment 24 hours from now. Also, shout outs. Shout outs to the new subs and the OG subs. Each video we shout out 10 new subs, 10 OG subs. If you want a chance at a shout out, all you gotta do, hit the subscribe button. And guys, while you're there, give the video a thumbs up. Okay, so I've been planning this for a couple months now, but in order to pull it off, I had to wait for Kristen to leave town. And guess what? That day has finally arrived. Leaving so soon? I'm gonna be gone for a week, guys. Behave. Okay, always do. No, you don't. Have fun, bye. Now that she's gone, let me show you what I've been planning. Okay, don't judge, but I've been saving up all of these boxes. Yeah, look at them. For like a month and a half. And I've got one specific purpose, to build a giant cardboard box fort. <laughs> Unfortunately, I still don't think that's gonna be enough. So we're gonna need to go get some more. Yeah, boxes are expensive too, like crazy expensive. This video might cost a little bit of money. Anyways, let's go. Looking for boxes. Bingo. Okay, I don't know how many we're gonna get, but let's get a bunch to start. Yeah, that looks like the ticket. Yeah! All right, we are home with our boxes. Think that'll be enough? We'll see. We have to get more. Go right down the street and get some. But before we just start constructing things, we need to map out a plan so we can get this right and make it epic. Because if I just start constructing boxes all over the place, it's probably gonna look stupid. And we want this thing to be amazing. So I'm gonna put together a sketch. And of course, I'm gonna take you through the process. And we're gonna get this thing done. Let's go. Okay, this should be pretty straightforward. Our entrance there, hallway, dead end, trap door, secret exit. At first glance, that's, you know, kind of basic, so we're gonna spice it up a little bit. For starters, we're gonna put a giant treat at the end. Boom. We're gonna add string maze, obstacles, pillow mountain, and there we go. I think that's a great start. We can uh, add or subtract as we go, but let's get started. Okay, we've got our plans. Now it's just time to start building. Clearly I couldn't start this project without something going horribly wrong, which is exactly what happened. Kristen FaceTimed me just at the start of my build. Yikes. All right, we're gonna just start construct. Oh. oh God, what does she want? Hey. Hey. What are you doing? Moving. I'm moving out. What? No, I'm not moving out, but remember how you told me not to construct a giant cardboard fortress for the dogs? I'm doing it. What? Yeah, I'm doing it. Oh, you... Nope, doing it. Nope, nope, gotta go, bye. Yeah, that's right. I just hung up on her. We're doing it. I have uh, two days to get this done, so let's get to work. We're gonna start with the entrance. Now, it's gonna be tricky to get this to stand up. There we go. We're gonna have to like attach a little hallway to the entrance. Hey, hey, not bad, kind of bad. All right, hey. All right, got the hallway done, but now we just gotta open it up. So, here goes nothing. There we go. Or not, we got tape, we'll fix it. Okie dokie, artichokey. Got some beautiful orange duct tape. There we go. Boom, secure. On to the next. Yeah, we're making progress. I think the thing that I need right now is to find a little piece to put right over here so that little heads don't go poking at the top, right? Should be able to find it over there. No problem, go take a look. All right. Get rid of those. Oh, oh. Hey, this should fit just. Hey, what you think about that? 
Where's PJ? Uh, Peach? PJ? PJ? Hey! Hi? What happened? I thought for sure you were gonna be in there. Are you gonna go in? No? Not yet? No, don't go in yet. It's not ready for you. And that concludes day one. You really can't complete a project like this without sufficient lighting. And it was nighttime. So I had no other choice but to start and hopefully finish the process by the next day. Okay guys, we're here back. Day two, about halfway done. To be perfectly honest, I'm not sure how I feel about this project. It's not going as well as I'd hoped. And not so much the build, I just, it's, it's more the purpose. I made it for the dogs and the dogs seem terrified by it. They won't even go near the entrance. No luck. I don't know. Like, part of me wants to give up and part of me wants to keep going because we're almost there. But either way, I'm gonna finish it. So, worst case scenario, it's done and the dogs don't wanna go through it, then I will just take you through it and maybe it inspires you to build your own cardboard maze. Uh, best case scenario, the dogs go through it and have a blast and enjoy it and love it. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put the camera on a time lapse just to kind of whip through the second half construction and then we'll see what happens. Real quick, before we finish the build, let me just kind of show you what I've got so far. It's not bad. It's not bad at all. Like, if I was a kid, I'd think it was spectacular. So, let's take a look. According to our map, so far we've got our entrance, this hallway, and our dead end. Except these kind of flip-flop. Let me show you. Okay, we've got our entrance here that goes up and around and comes to this dead end. So what do they do? How do they get out? Well, surprise! They come out this little secret flappy door. Yeah, that's what I got. So, here we go. Our box fort is done. And as you can see, PJ wants nothing to do with it. Scared to death of it. I even put cheese down in the end there. Not having it, not having it at all. Okay, it's still silly and it's still fun and I'm still gonna take you through it. If I could fit, I don't know, we'll make it work. But yeah, let's do a tour of our da -da 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 box fort for the dogs that is now box fort for a full grown adult. Quick update, I just added a few extra little surprises. So here we go, we're going in. Without further ado, here we go. All right, you're gonna have a hard time fitting. You enter in and you're immediately Turn to this corner, which what? Happens to be a dead end. Tricky, tricky. You look up. Hey, a nice little skylight there, but you can't get out that way, so what do you do? Well, let me just back up and show you. Right here is a secret door, which is gonna be really hard, but we're gonna try to squeeze through it. It's dog size. I made it for a dog. Either way, I'll push the camera through and meet you on the other side, but. Oh, 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 and now we're in the red room. We turn the corner here, and we've got another skylight. Hey, we go through here, and here is the pillow room. Nice little blankie. We work our way around and out. Ooh, little string obstructions. Hi, Penny. Having fun out there? All right, and through the string maze we go. Hi. Hi, what you doing? Uh, don't judge, don't judge, I know. Oh, I'm judging. I know you said you didn't want me to make a big mess, but I made a big mess. I did this for the dogs. And they didn't use it. It is what it is, because it is pretty spectacular. It is pretty cool. Do you want to use it? I just used it. I barely fit. <laughs> you want to see if I can go in? If you want, but... Okay, I'll go. All right, ready? Count me out. One, two, three, go. All right. <laughs> okay, all right, pull it back. Pull it back. <laughs> yeah, so, I don't know. I don't know, I'm probably gonna tear it down. I'm gonna set the camera down, see if they do it on their own. It was still fun. Yeah. Oh! Hey, she's going in. Hey, Maybe what do we have? Oh. Come on, Penny. That's the exit, but okay. Um, back oh. it up, back it up. Welcome home. <laughs> I'm Good. cleaning it up. Womp womp. The giant box fort I built for the dogs was a massive failure. I mean, the fort itself wasn't a failure, but the fact that the dogs didn't want to go in it, failure. Or at least I think thought it was. I just happened to have the camera rolling facing the exit and about a half an hour later this happened. 